Did you see the image in this church of the woman nursing the animal, the dog, with her breast? No. Where was that? Oh, my goodness. Um, I, I edited a video that blocks out um, some of the bad stuff here. Here, let me text it to you. But I'm going to take it off screen. Let me text it to you real quick. I know you, can, Tim can't see what's on my screen. Oh, snap. This is the in the is church. That? What is that thing? It's a woman nursing a dog. On one breast, oh she has gosh. a baby. On the other breast, she's nursing a dog. That's crazy. Isn't it disgusting? It's vile. Yeah. What is wrong with what these people? Doing? And why would they take they pictures doing? of it and put it in a Catholic church? The mother's milk is for the baby, not for the town dog. What yeah. is wrong with these people? And and why would you, it says ba, here's the, here's the message, Tim. Here's the message. It says we are everything is connected in Spanish. What it's saying is the dog is equal to the baby. It's true. It's We're true. all interconnected. The dog has equal value to the baby. Yeah. And Mother Earth has equal value to Mother Mary. You try to 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 lawyer this or or to to put it on the shelf and analyze the way you know people on the sensible spectrum of things have, and they said, okay, the Amazon Synod, this is going to be pretextual. It's going to be pretext for the agenda of um, ending priestly celibacy and perhaps, dare I say it, the ordination of women. Mm. But, and I'm not saying it's not that, they're probably gonna do that too, but look what else they're fitting in. That was a surprise, all this paganism crap. You know who nailed this was Father Dave Nix. He said, women's ordination and uh, married priest is on the agenda, but it's a distraction to get the conservatives all riled up over something. He said the main agenda is paganism. Having been there, it is all paganism all the time. This is a wow. pagan infiltration into the church. They were in the garden and they had rattles that they were shaking, you know, and they were dancing around and in a circle holding hands. They had a female shaman leading their liturgy. The Pope sat there. The Pope sat there and watched it. And yeah. received a black ring from the woman. What the really? Hell? Literally, what the hell is that? Yeah. Did you know Leo the Thirteenth used to walk around that garden praying his Saint Michael exorcism? They say he had a little booklet and he would take his daily walk in the Vatican Gardens, and that was his time to pray the exorcism over the world. And I now did know that Francis yeah. is in the same garden with pagan rites. Idols, black rings, chants, circles, female shaman, a.k.a. a witch. All this stuff going on inside the walls of the Vatican. But right now, we're kind of waiting to see what shapes up. Let's see what the point of the synod really ends up being. Because we've been predicting it for paganism. months. We've, it seems to be paganism. Paganism. Clearly. Yes. Idols, I, earth I, I, worship, shamans. All the world's secular press are like, what in the hell is going on? Yes. Seriously. Like, right. what is going on in the church? Like, we're secularists. We kind of like that the Roman Catholic Church is ostensibly consuming itself. Yeah. Right. But, but I mean, not that it really is. It'll prevail against the gates of hell. But what the hell is going on? But even there, like, this is weird, bro. The young people that are coming into the church love Thomas. Love mm -hmm. the Gergou Lagrange way of doing real Thomistic studies and and the the nature and the supernature that's represented by that, we, they're, they're they're sick of both of these two schools of of uh, Vatican II communio and concilium yeah. and all that. That doesn't. I mean, go watch our video on hermeneutic of continuity. Many yeah. many people, even on the right, misunderstand what it is. I think. Yes. But the point is, we don't. We, I don't know. What do you want us to do? Some people contact me. They're like, "Why aren't you doing something?" I'm like, "What do you want me to do? Be the crazy soldier and bayoneting thin air?" I write about it. I speak about it. But I don't. We. No one knows what to do. The smartest people in the world. I'm not saying them. The other guys. Are the, the yeah. you know the best heads in the world are like, let's see what plays out and see if then we come to a decision point. We're not even at a decision point. Yeah. We have no power right now. Yeah. Just know, teach everyone, show everyone that's on the fence about 
Taylor's book, Infiltration, or about the theories we put forward here, theories, show them what's happening in Rome right now. They're all going to be like, what the actual heck is going on? I think we can say hell. What the hell is going on?